Hey, 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 it's October, which is my favorite time of the year. And you know what that means? For one month, I won't get mercilessly bullied for wearing all black. That's right, it's Halloween. Spooky season, baby. The month of frights and delights. And so what better way to kick it off with some good old fashioned horror games. For those who aren't aware, Itch.io is a wonderful land of hope and dreams for the indie dev. However, it can also be a land of horror and nightmares. But for me, it's content. <laughs> this is fucked. I hate this. I hate this. <laughs> Fuck me. Oh my god. Now, those of us who don't leave our rooms need some way to feel alive. To get that rush of adrenaline. Naturally, horror games are beloved by the masses. And thankfully, there's no achievement greater than scaring the shit out of grown men. Make them cry. Scream. Maybe piss their pants. Hospitalize them even. But not all horror games can be scary. And thus, I propose a theory. Itch.io indie horror will either be the goofiest, silliest experience imaginable, or be so psychologically traumatizing that your grandchildren will continue to experience the nightmares. So without further ado, join me as I put my theory to death and I explore the world of Itch.io indie horror. First up, I'll be playing The Touch by Krigor. Also, all links to the games uh, can be found in description of the video. I am prepared to face the unknown lurking in the shadows. The touch is an immersive short horror experience set in an ordinary suburban American home. This spine-chilling game inspired by PS1-style graphics is designed to take you on the edge of your seat as you unravel the mysterious events unfolding before your eyes. As a young woman living with your baby, your unsettling journey begins one fateful night when a strange noise in the living room awakens you. Step by step, the eerie atmosphere grows thicker, and you soon find yourself haunted by an unseen presence. But beware, not everything is as it seems. Dare to confront the unknown and unravel the secrets hidden within your seemingly ordinary home. The touch will leave you feeling haunted, as if the unseen presence remains with you even after the game ends. Will you survive the night of this bone-chilling suburban nightmare? There's only one way to find out. Join the experience now, and remember, you are never truly alone. Well, 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 doesn't this bloke just look so, so friendly? So, so nice. Don't come near me, sir. Please. I don't want to see you. Okay. There's a strange noise coming from the living room. I should go check it out. Okay. Nice suburbia. Uh, howdy, neighbors. Nice dog. Somewhere barking in the distance. Nice artwork on the wall. Moving very slowly. Hello, child. Fuck you, one ugly baby. Okay, I'm gonna go away from uh, really really love the art on the walls. We're a big art person, aren't we? What the fuck was that? Nah, hell nah. I'm going back this way. Fuck that shit. I don't I don't wanna go downstairs. I don't wanna go downstairs. Why would I wanna go downstairs now? I'm content, like I just I can go back to bed. I don't wanna I'm like corner peeking. I could have sworn I turned the TV off before going to bed. Well, maybe you did, and maybe if we just stayed upstairs, we wouldn't have to deal with this. Of course it's playing static. Of course it's just playing static. What the fuck? <laughs> I don't like this. Did that chair fall over by itself? What's going on here? Maybe we don't need to know what's going on here. Maybe we can just leave. You know, what about that? Have we considered that? Oh god, I'm... Hi. Hello. Hi, sir. What's going on with this TV? I just turned it off. Now it's back on. This is starting to freak me out. Yeah, it's also starting to me freak me out. Oh, fuck. Is he still here? I'm, like, actually moving my head around, like, in person, trying to peek around the corners. I fucking hate horror games. I'm such a little bitch. That's the hallway. That's up. Oh, that's him. That's the child's room. That's the child's room. Hi. I'm not sure what I just saw, but I have a terrible feeling. I need to make sure my baby is safe. Maybe we don't. Have you considered that? Maybe... Look, there's a door. There's a nice door right here. I just want to leave. In the middle of the night without any purpose. With... 
I have a purpose. I have a purpose to leave the house. I don't need the baby. I don't think... Look, you can always... You can have another kid. You know, you can have another kid. It's a baby. How were you that attached to it already? I don't want to go upstairs where the little silly guy is. Where is he? Oh, boy. Oh, fuck me. I am a little bitch. I am such a little bitch. You could call me the biggest little bitch if you want. Or the littlest bitch. Uh, <laughs> no, 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 he's not taking a shit. Jesus Christ, I hate this. <laughs> Fuck me. Oh my fucking god, I hate this. Hi, baby. Hi. Yep. No, let me leave, let me leave, let me leave. Let me leave. Let me leave, let me leave. God, that baby is ugly. Oh, fuck. A, B, C, D, E, F, G. Nope, that's the window. That's, that's eyes. Let me go. Let me go. <laughs> H, I, J, K, L, M, N, O, P. U, R, S. Let me leave. Let me leave. I can't open the door. Take the baby, sir. Take the baby. You can have the baby. You can have the baby, sir. Do you want my baby? You can have my baby. I don't care about my baby. It's ugly anyways. <laughs> oh, fuck me. Okay. I'm going. I'm just- I'm going. Why am I so slow? Run, girly, run. Please, lady, run. Fuck me. Is this a, it's coming for me. It's coming for me. It's coming for me. It's coming for me. Let me out. Let me out. Oh, Jesus Christ. He's right there. Fuck me. Oh, okay, I got out. Oh, my palms. As you make your escape, a chilling realization washes over you. You've seen the sinister being before. Lurking in the shadows of your darkest memory. It's been with you since that sinister night when you stole the baby and killed its real mother. Holy shit! Silently observing, the creature now reveals itself, forcing you to face the darkness within you. You found safety, but only temporarily. Fucking hell. Jesus. Okay. Well then. The Touch Chapter 2. Good game. Uh, props to Kriegor. This shit... It, it got my heart rate up. It got my heart rate up. I was scared. I was certainly scared. Good job, uh, Kriegor. Link in the description. Um, really short and sweet. That was a good one. Uh, on to the next one. Next up is The Microwave Paradox by Sirius Daniel. Again, all links in the description. In The Microwave Paradox, the short horror game, you play as a man who received an off after test, a super new microwave from the very big microwave producing company. Your task is to test and check how the microwave works with different types of food. Nothing complicated, of course. Onto The Microwave Paradox by Sirius Daniel. Let's just jump straight into it, I suppose. Fuck, I'm still like shaking, I'm still shaking. Oh. A very big microwave producing company provided you the new super microwave for testing purposes. Now you're going to test your microwave with different types of food. Okay. I'm still shaken up by that last Hello. one. Hello. Thanks for agreement to participate yes. in our super microwave testing. We hope you will get the best experience oh. with your super microwave. Or in order to get better experience, yep. we recommend you to watch the video tutorial, which will teach you how to use the microwave mm. provided by our company. Jordan Ben. Okay, I have a shit arm on me. Uh, okay. So this is my microwave. Very cool. I can open and close it. Or nuts. Fuck. Right. Oh no, okay. I thought I lost that one behind the microwave. What's over here? Yeah, okay. I've got a VHS. That might be handy. Can I microwave the VHS? Whoop. This is a terrifying bathroom. What the fuck? What the fuck is this? Okay, I'll ignore it for now. I swear... Play that back. I swear to fuck I saw that microwave, like, peeking out the corner. Hold, hold, hang on. What the fuck? I don't know, like, I don't trust anything my eyes see anymore. Okay, I'm gonna run that back in post now. I'm already fucking scared. I'm scared of a microwave. What the fuck? The super microwave can become your best friend. Oh, that's it nice. It can help you to make your food better. It can even okay. watch a movie with you. Aww. 
you have absolutely That's no reason to not to trust your microwave. Of course, Attention. I trust it. Microwaves cannot talk. If of your course. microwave started to talk with you, then follow next step. Okay. First, make sure there is nobody hidden inside the microwave, because microwaves don't talk itself. No, they don't. Second, try to isolate yourself from the super microwave. It is better to lock all your house doors and put the super microwave outside. Okay. Don't worry, your life is safe now. Okay. And finally, try not to talk and interact with microwaves. Some aspects Hi, little of, guy. of microwaves on humans are not yet fully understood. You know, I gotta say, I wasn't worried about my microwave trying to kill me until he said your microwave shouldn't kill you. So, take that as you will, I guess. Can I put the VHS in the microwave? Surely. Now I can put it on the microwave. That's close enough. Okay, I don't think I can. Unfortunate. Okay, well, he belongs in there, I guess. Uh, oh, they're not. You know, I love putting a donut in the microwave. Whoop. If I can... Whoop. It's on. It works. Can I put the box in the microwave? No. That's really unfortunate. Okay. A burger in the microwave. That sounds good. Uh, what's over here? There was this that I found in the bathroom. What is this? Oh, it's biscuits? I don't fucking know. Uh, should I be concerned about my radio? No. Nope. I'm just going to ignore it. I'm just going to ignore the radio turning on randomly. Um, let's just keep on mic. I'm noticing I'm not taking out anything in the microwave. That might just be me though, I guess. Well, I could just... Box fort time. That's nice. I can make a little box fort. Uh, more juice or soda or whatever, I guess, can go in the microwave. Mmm, oh. Okay, I took the burger out by accident. My bad. It's looking yummy, though. I'm making a meal. Um, uh, I'm making a meal in the microwave, and I'll sit down and watch TV with my microwave, actually. Because the movie said we could. So, it sounds like a good idea. What's this on the floor? Just magazines. And I put the toaster in the microwave. No! That's so unfortunate. That's something I love to do. I love putting the toaster in the microwave. They're best friends. Oh. That's not great. Oh. But my microwave broke. Hi, who's calling me? Did my pizza arrive? You have broken the microwave, oh. which our company provided to you. How did you know? Purposes. How, how did you, you know? You are a pathetic and worthless person. That's just fucked don't up. To own our I don't super think you need microwave. to bring up that. Our sales manager will now come to your house and take your life okay. as a fine. Take my life? I didn't install these lights. What are you? I'll throw a box. Adam. I'm armed and I'm dangerous. Don't come at me. Don't fuck with me. I'm dangerous. Oh my fucking god. Who is that? Fuck you, sir. Oh my god. <laughs> I thought he was going to come from the door. Holy shit. That scared me. <laughs> Thanks for playing. I... Honestly, fair enough. If I sent someone a microwave and they broke my microwave, I'd also kill them. I can't be too harsh. Fuck. <laughs> oh, I'm so scared of horror games. Why am I doing this? Fuck. I hate this. Okay. That was the microwave in the microwave paradox. Uh, that was actually really fun. That was an interesting concept. I I was not expecting that end of just being fucking killed by whoever that thing was. Uh, good game. Good game. Fuck. <laughs> I'm so scared. Okay. On to the next one. Finally is the Arrowhead Incident by Nick F. You are a victim of the Arrowhead Incident. One lonely night in your apartment you receive a strange package containing a video camera. This camera is the only way to see it. It's determined to find you. It lurks in the dark. Your only tool is your camera. It's old and bulky, but it will protect you if you know how to use it. It's your only source of light, but don't trust anyone. 
anything you see or hear. Final game because my heart can't take anymore. Uh, the Arrowhead Incident by Nick F. Fuck, I'm <laughs> not looking forward to this. I just want to get this done. My heart rate is actually fucked up. I need to lay down after this. Wow, in my room. I can't sleep. I really should stop staying up so late. Honestly, bro, me too. It's not good. Anything in the closet? Nothing in the closet. Nice books. Lots of books. I just moved. I don't even have anything to put here yet. Okay, fair enough. Uh, pizza. Marco's Pizzeria. Very cool. Nothing to really play. I'm going to continue this rant because someone would get upset. Fair enough. I'm going to leave the lights on, actually. I'm too scared to have them off. Okay, I'm just leaving a croissant out. That's cool. Um, is that... Hang on. Is that just a bowl of cereal that he's just left out? What the fuck, bro? Clean your shit up. Super fast jellyfish, okay. It's disgusting. Tastes just like chicken. He said clean it all up. Bro, you got like a whole ass sandwich and bread here. What do you mean you don't know how long it's been out here for? What's wrong with you? Nasty ass motherfucker. Nasty. Do I need to... Oh, I can sprint. That's not a good sign. I have to run all that. I don't like the fact that I can sprint. That's never a good sign. Super fast jellyfish, beef stew, and bread. Okay. All this work's got me kind of hungry. Bro, you had a whole ass sandwich there. You could have just, like... Pizza. But you could have just ate the sandwich. Like, what's wrong with you? Okay. Put your phone. 30% off. That's a pretty good deal. Free delivery as well. Marco's Pizzeria. Very nice. My phone's here. Looks like a fucking calculator, though. <laughs> Medium pepperoni. Sounds good, actually. Yeah. Oh, pepperoni is a bomb-ass pizza. Watch some TV whilst I wait. I don't like the fact that I can sprint. It's never a good sign. Military? Okay. Fucking didn't know Moist Critical was the... Okay, finally my pizza's here. I'm just ignore the fact that he said, like, don't answer the phone or the door. My key. Probably in a drawer. Looks like a picture of my window. That's not terrifying at all. There's the key. Okay. Um, that's not terrifying at all. Pizza? Pizza's coming in big boxes now? Sure. I'm gonna close this. See to camera. Oh, yeah. That's cool. I'm gonna zoom in and out. What is over here? I hate that. Check the closet. I don't like that that... Oh, fuck. I'm gonna... Uh -huh. Oh my fucking god. Jesus Christ. Holy fuck. Oh my... No. This is fucked. This is fucked. You cannot expect me to... Dude, this is fucked. I hate this. I hate this. That scared the shit out of me. Like, be right back. I gotta fucking change my pants. Oh my. Check left, check right. 
Okay, Pika's right here. <gasps> oh my fucking god. <laughs> this is so fine. Everything's fine. I'm a manly man. It's in my closet? Okay. Oh, I'm a manly man. I'm such a manly man. I got a huge dick. I'm not scared. Hide? The bed? Okay. I'm not scared. I'm not scared. Oh my god, it's right there. I am nothing without my light. That's so true. I'm not. <laughs> Can I leave now? I'm so... I don't want to leave. I'm going to turn these lights on right fucking now. Yes. But he did just say I am nothing without the lights, so... Maybe I could just continue hiding. I'm a manly man, I sprint. It was not this far away last time. It was not this far away last time. Oh my god, okay. That's it, right? Quit playing with those... Well, he's dead. He's, he's dead as hell. There's no danger here. I feel like... You yell so I know you're I'm okay. I don't know about that one. I want to leave. Let me get out of here. Let me leave. Let me leave. I don't have the key? That's great. Oh boy. So I gotta take his? Where the monster is? Fuck that, dude. Climb out the fucking window. I have a window here. I can make it out of there. Fuck going into it. Which one even was his? Oh, it'd be this one. Of course it'd be this one with the with the blood under Fuck me. Oh. <laughs> wow, I really like what you've done with the room, sir. With your nice blood on the floor. Where the hell did he go? Please help the code. Listen. Six, seven, eight, four. I have no idea. Two. Seven. Is that eight? So can you just like yell it out? That'd make it a lot easier. If you could just two, three, four, five, six, seven. Seven. Three. Four, five, six, six, two, seven, six, two, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, seven, six, two, eight, seven, six, two, eight, seven, six, two, eight. That better be right. Good. I can get the fuck out of here. He requires my help. Fuck that. Fuck that. I'm getting it out of here. Please come in. The key's in the drawer. I got the key. You can't trick me. You can't fool me. I don't have the key. I don't have the key? What the fuck do you mean I don't have a key? I got a key. I, I, I just picked up a key. I just picked up... I don't want to go back in here. I don't want to be back. The key's in the drawer. The key's in the drawer. Okay. Oh, what's that say? Get out. Oh, that's so cool. That's really cool. There it is. Yep. It better. I'm fucking getting out. What do you mean I don't have the fucking key? Oh, fuck this. I'll have to take his. I don't want to take his. Why can't I just go out the window? Oh, there's, an there's another... There's a lock on there. That's really cool. Oh, there's a lock on his door. On the one that, that the monster's in? I don't know about this one. Can I... Can I just... I'm fucking terrified. I'm shaking. I'm shaking. Oh my 
fucking god. Holy shit. <laughs> oh my fucking god. Oh my god. I'm still- I'm not dead? I'm not dead. I'm not dead. Oh wow, this is just like Roblox doors. <laughs> this is just like the doors in Roblox. Run. You don't have to tell me twice. I'm fucking out of here. I'm fucking out of here. I don't know if it's chasing me. Is it chasing me? Is it chasing- I don't know. I'm, I'm out of here though. No. Why am I being- I'm fucking shitting myself. I'm just- I don't even look back. I feel like I'm not sprinting that fast. I can't tell if it's chasing me or not. I don't see it. Am I- Please either maybe just be shooting me. I'd be fine with that. Shoot me so I don't have to deal with it anymore. Oh my god. Oh, okay. Incident report. 5325. On the night of 17th August, shortly past 4am, reports started coming in of a Class K phenomena being spotted in and around Redacted. Information was forwarded to Redacted Jimenez and Junior Advisor Redacted. As per the Class K protocol, units were shortly thereafter issued to 4320 Arrowhead Street to cease further contact with residents and evaluate the situation. NPA Corporal Williams lead, led the team into the building where the phenomena had been taking place. Once they entered, one supposed victim- I am a fucking victim, yes, I am the victim here- uh, was spotted running towards the team as they entered. The entity was spotted directly behind the victim, after which all members of the unit discharged their weapons and opened fire on the entity. Currently, there is no evidence to suggest the Class K entity has been neutralized. Ah, that's fantastic. No, that's just great. That's- that's fantastic. That's so cool. That's so cool that he's still just running amok. Running amok, dude, going up to a silly, goofy little shenanigans. Telling me to run, and I'm nothing without the light. That's so cool of him, that he's just still around. The victim was left unharmed. Unharmed? Unharmed? Bitch, I'm fucking traumatized now. I'm... I'm not sleeping tonight. Straight up, I will not be sleeping tonight. And was transported to Redacted Hospital. That better be like a psych psychiatric ward. After a sweep of the building, one additional victim was found badly mutilated in their apartment. Their body was most likely partially eaten. Sorry about that. My pizza didn't arrive. Uh, I was a little hungry. I, I just wanted my pep I just wanted my pepperoni pizza. And the victim is yet to be identified. Documents and reports will likely be forwarded to defense unit at Sector 5. Further in incidents are very likely. Any and all units should be prepared for action when needed. That's so cool. That more incidents are likely. Look, so long as it doesn't happen to me. I'm happy. Yeah, the Arrowhead incident by Nick F. Fucking bravo. That was terrifying. That was a genuinely terrifying game. Um, the camera was, yeah, being entirely reliant on your camera was, that was good to be able to see it. Fuck, I'm shaking. Okay, I guess this credits roll. That's all I've got for today. All, all for the video. Um, if you want to see more, if you want to see me suffer more, I'm down to play more horror games. It was actually really fun, besides the fact that I'm, like, shaking. My brain is so just fried, I'm sorry. Um, yeah, that's all for the video. Uh, if you want to see more horror games, please let me know. This was a blast. And, yeah, I will see you in the next video. Bye-bye for now.